The positive thing about this NHL lockout, just a couple of positive things. Okay. We have more time to devote to some of the more obscure sports around BC. Now, tonight, CTV's Jason Pira is on a competition you've probably engaged in at some time in your life, and a man who is beefing up his training this year. What guy doesn't like a good steak? He is the master of meat. I still say Canada has the best beef. The filet aficionado. That's world class. That's gold medal right there. But there is more than meets the ribeye for the man simply known as the butcher. Anything else for you today? Do not be fooled by his friendly customer <laughs> service. Doesn't matter if you're my best friend. I, I still want to rip your arm off. Patrick Callan is an arm wrestler. I just love the intensity of it all. A seven-time national champion, a 24-year veteran of the sport. These days, I'm more motivated by some of the guys I train. Here you go. Guys like Stop. Nathan and Clayton hunker down in Callan's garage once a week. The back alley trio just returned from the worlds in Brazil. Focus more on this, Clayton, like this. They're already trained to qualify for next year's world championship in Poland. I have no doubt in my mind I'll be on the podium next year. Yes, Callan is confident, but not cocky. I have an unassuming body type, so most people look at me and go, oh, this guy can't be that strong. But just Three. take a look. Come on, two more, push it. Five, good work. Keep going, six. Arm wrestling has evolved over the years. Callan says it's no longer about pure brute strength, but rather reaction time. That's better. And most of all, technique. It's not the big biceps that win the match. It's it's really all in the hand and the wrist. And so Callan focuses on punishing hand-specific exercises, like flipping 10-pound plates all the way to 25-pound plates. Nice work. Let's just compare here. Like, let's look at your hands. <laughs> Those are butcher hands. Butcher hands with sausage fingers who fuels himself up with, you guessed it. That's a man steak, right there. I've been eating a steak every day for probably the last 10 years, every day. Every day? Every day. Without fail? Without fail, not even heartburn. He deals with rare meat, who competes in a rare sport. Now I'm gonna take his wrist out. Two unique passions that really go hand in hand for Patrick Kellman. In one of my first tournaments, um, one of my first mentors uh, called me up to the stage, and my technique at that time was the chop. So it was the butcher's chop. Uh, unbeknownst to me, he said, up next is Patrick the Butcher Cowan. Jason Pierce, CTV Sports. I can't flip a quarter, let alone one of those ten plates. Oh, you see the muscle that yeah. was right in there? I mean, I, when we were kids, we loved to arm sure. wrestle. It's fine, but... It's a little different. Yeah. All right, That's coming up, a long border has a close encounter with nature. He was speeding down a hill at 65 kilometers an hour, then a deer got in his way. I'll tell you what happened.